When our patients are located in the ICU cubicle, they look pretty locked in, but in fact, everything's oriented for the instant detachment of the patient and his equipment from that environment. The infusion pump rack is fixed to the bed. One plug disconnects it from the wall. The monitoring equipment is fixed into the power, col power column, but one module can come out and be attached to a laptop-like display to provide perfect monitoring anywhere in the hospital for that patient. Similarly, the bed itself is the transport trolley, and it too can be literally instantly moved out of that cubicle along with the patient when you have to do it fast. One of the truly unique technologies in this ICU is our infusion racks, which are mounted directly on the patient bed. They can hold up to 10 or 15 small syringe infusion pumps and a couple of large volume pumps as well. All the electrical outlets are mounted to the top of the rack and only one cord has to be connected to the unit itself. When the patient travels, all the infusion equipment goes along with him and can be downloaded onto a special stand wherever it is you're going to. When one of our cardiac surgical patients has to go someplace in a hurry, we don't have time to move the patient to another bed or transport device. So the bed he's in is the transport device. Similarly, you can't afford to stop vital signs monitoring, stop drug infusion therapy, or stop respiratory therapy just because the patient is in the hallway. We believe our system allows all those vital functions to continue in a safe and uninterrupted fashion, no matter whether the patient's in the ICU cubicle or out on transport.